Hi everyone, welcome back to TWT. My name is Lynn and today I'm gonna to do your reading. Um, see what happened in the past, what is your current energy and what's gonna happen in the future, all right? So let's go ahead and get started with the Empress with three shuffles. Okay, this is like, hang on. All right, that was the first shuffle. Let me do the second one. All right, let's go back into the past and what happened. Okay, here we go. All right, pass energy. You have the more to write, and then current energy. You know what? Oh my god. Current energy. Let me do that again. Honest again. And then let me look at the future energy. Appetite. All right. And we got all three cards. Let me pull it up and show you. So this is for the past energy, Demortorite. Calm, patience, support, and tranquility. Uh, vibration number four is for the throat chakra. It's for Leo. Wow, Leo. And the information is, I am centered with tranquility. Wow. And then for the current energy is Onyx, again, for protection, strength, self-control. Um, for the root chakra, vibration number six, and it's for Capricorn and Leo. Wow. Wait a minute. Wait, this is supposed to be Virgo. Yeah, this is for Virgo, okay. And then it says, I find confidence and strength in my life experiences. And then for the future energy is appetite, communication, teaching, and awareness. Um, it's for the throat chakra, probation number nine, and it's for Gemini and Libra. And it says, I'm receptive to spiritual wisdom and reconnection. So, you know what? I feel like I forgot to show you Onyx. That's what it looks like. I mean, I pulled it up before, but just to show you. And then for the future energy is Appetite. And for the past energy is Demortorite. 
Okay. All right. So let's see what the tarot deck has to say. I'm going to go back into the past energy. So it's for Virgo, your number nine. And it's for the Hermit card. So let me do five shuffles for you. Wow, this came out, the moon card. energy what about it and then current energy with onyx what about it oh my god okay this came out i'm just gonna show this i'm gonna use this the full card came out for that energy and then what about the future energy And the bottom of the deck is Page of Swords. All right. So, what were the other cards that came out? So, let's go back to the past with the, wow, the tower. Oh, my God. This is going to be big change coming up. If it hasn't already happened, like, there's going to be a major change going on. Or there was a major change that, that happened. And then for the current energy is the fool. So yeah, like taking a risk, um, new start, moving, starting over, all this stuff, basically like the unknown. And then the future energy is four cups. Okay. And then let me see what Archangel Michael has to say. So let me do four shuffles. For the emperor, detached from the situation. Your children are watched over by angels. Energy healing work. And romance angels are helping you. Oh my god. Okay. So, single Virgos, what is your message? And then Virgos that are not single, what is your message? <laughs> okay, this one already popped up. Shield yourself. That's for... Virgos that are not single. And then the bottom of the deck is let go of fear now. Wow. All right. So what about single Virgos? Spend more time outdoors. Wow. All right. So we're going to go back into the past energy. Um... The mortuary and then the tower came out. So the tower means, yeah, big change. Um, okay, I'm getting tranquility. Ew. <laughs> that was not me. That was my dog. <laughs> That's not disgusting. Um, Yeah, so you were able to stay calm and tranquil even though there was a big change going on. It was like staying calm in the middle of the storm. I don't know how you did it, but you did it. So whatever that was, you stayed calm and you stayed tranquil and you kept your composure. Even though like deep inside you were like falling apart. And everyone else was falling apart. But 
you stay strong and you stay calm, okay? So that was in the past, so that, that already happened. Um, Onyx is for your current energy. And because the full card came out, um, this is something new, like, like a change or something unknown, like you're taking a risk into something unknown or new. So, you know what? I'm getting protection. So, because right now some of you are like taking a big risk or you're doing something that is new, you may be moving or you may have ended something or you're about to start something new. So basically, you don't know where this is going, but you went ahead and took the first step. So you're being protected while you're doing that. And yeah, the full card came out. So yeah, it's something that, it's something unknown and you're taking a risk. Um, it's scary, yes, but you're being guided and protected in the process, all right? Um, for the future energy, this hasn't happened yet, but it's gonna happen. So appetite came out and then the four cups also came out. So four cups is basically like like you're bored. Um like like you have things that make you happy, but you're like, eh, you want more. Like they they don't make you happy anymore. And you're being offered something new, something different, something better. So I think that's the risk. That's part of the risk. Because you felt like, you know what? I want change. And I want something better. So you went ahead and took that risk because you were bored with what you have, okay? I'm so, okay, you know what? I'm seeing this connected. So there was a big change with the tower. And then you started over or you ended something. And it, it's almost like this change happened and you started over, you took a risk because you want something better. That's what I'm getting, okay? And with appetite, awareness, that's what I'm getting, awareness. It's like, it's almost like, yeah, you're, you're getting this awareness that you're taking this risk and you're leaving things behind because you know that you want something better. You want more and you're already getting bored with what you have and you want more okay that's what i'm getting so um if you are single and you're a virgo spend more time outdoors and if you're not single shield yourself yep protect yourself and uh, i'm also getting yeah protection for the current energy protection starting over and then for virgos that are not single it says shield yourself so yeah you need to, you need to protect yourself all right so virgo i hope this helps you in some way and um if you enjoyed the video please leave a like share comment or subscribe and i will talk to you soon